his doctors. As Jackson's medical records are seized, a bigger, more gruesome picture is now emerging. ABC News has obtained these exclusive photos taken of Jackson in 2002, with an enormous wound on his leg and visible linear puncture marks along veins on his ankles and feet. This is a hidden part of the body. It's not on his arms, his hands. So that's a, a common uh, finding that you see in people who are injecting drugs uh, for illicit purposes. These injection marks are all located just above the, the various veins on the leg and the shin and the foot. So there's easy access to the bloodstream. Yet in a rare interview, Dr. Klein told Diane Sawyer when he treated Jackson, he didn't see anything that made him worry. I saw nothing at that point in time that would make me worry whatsoever. But here's the problem with Michael. No matter what he wanted, someone would give it to him. Experts tell ABC there's just no legitimate medical explanation for these marks. The wound on the shin area of his leg uh, is typical of someone who's injecting drug on a regular basis. What happens is the tissue becomes severely infected. ABC News has learned that DEA investigators are talking to Teva Pharmaceuticals, the maker of the powerful hospital anesthetic Propofol found in Jackson's home. A source tells ABC News that DEA agents contacted Teva about a specific lot of the drug connected to the Jackson death investigation.